Taylor is an awesome surfer, great person, always fun to see him. No matter how big or small the waves are, he can always kill it on this high performance board. I don't understand that yet. You know, the guy's 6'4 and 200 pounds, and he's nose riding a 9'1 on a one foot wave, you know. But right on, more power to him, he's killing it. I think, you know, I'd love to see him win the world title. You know, he's definitely got the style and the ability, you know, and the good attitude to be a world champion. So. That'd be an awesome thing to see. Okay, next is Taylor Jensen, who was just on the phone. Hey, Taylor, how's oh, it going? Oh, Taylor, hi, hey, guy. Sorry we missed you. Yeah, he's very extreme. He has tendencies of cruising in the air. Radical maneuvers from the tail. He astro projects. Astro projects his longboard. Into the air. I love his style, really powerful off the tail, still smooth nose rider. He's, he's definitely pushing the limits of like high performance longboarding. He's amazing. He doesn't look like he's trying that hard, but he's doing things that most people can't do on a shortboard. He's doing it on a longboard. He rips. One rule in my life and in most of my friends' life is respect. The longboarding community in general is respect. You know, you earn your respect, and once you get it, it's important to continually be given respect. And just basically, don't disrespect anybody. You know, your elders especially. Like I see young kids, and I mean, I've been there before too. And you know, you forget about the respect that you need to show to those guys. They've been surfing here for 20 years longer than me. You know, and so what if they're just hanging out, cruising on the wave, you know? So what, they're having just as much fun as you would be. Mm -hmm. 